Aiwasayo. My name is Ting Ting. Unfortunately, that, that is all the Korea, Korean that I know. I've known Angus for nearly a decade. I was his roommate in the past, and his wingman the night he first met Yuna at a friend's party where it all began. Tonight, I had prepared a collection of very embarrassing stories about Angus, which I would love to share with you all. But unfortunately, Angus's lawyer, Michael Cohen, paid me to keep those stories to myself. Some of you may know how much Yuna loves watermelon. She could probably eat an entire one by herself if nobody was watching. As I was writing this speech, suddenly I had a shower thought. Angus is a human watermelon. <laughs> They're both round. They're both red. Well, not yet, but wait until he's had some wine. They're both down to earth. They're both very sweet. And they both never fail to put a smile on Yuna's face. Just like Yuna can't get enough watermelon, it's clear she can't get enough of Angus. Angus loves Yuna back just as much, if not more. He's patient with Yuna, can translate Yuna logic when the rest of us can't follow, and supports Yuna in any way he can. Sometimes that means letting Yuna have the last piece or two of fried chicken, or giving her the space and time to painstakingly choose between 10 different shades of white paint for the living room walls, or doing her English homework due the next morning. Angus always wants the best for Yuna, and at the end of the day, Angus is the happiest when Yuna is happy. As Angus's roommate, I was in the unique position of seeing their relationship grow from its exciting beginnings to the deep bond it is today. What I admire the most about their relationship is that although Angus and Yuna are fundamentally very different people, they don't look to change each other and actually encourage each other to be who they naturally are. They may, they may jokingly sigh at each other's quirks, but the truth is, these quirks are part of the many reasons why they love each other. Hey, Yuna, do you remember you once told us you chose to move to San Diego because you're looking for sunshine? <laughs> On those rare rainy days in San Diego, or wherever life takes you both, know that you can always count on Angus to be your sunshine. <laughs> Congratulations to you two both from the bottom of my heart. May your life together be as beautiful as the sunsets in San Diego. Thank you.